हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आज हम क्लास सिक्स का ज्योग्राफी का चैप्टर नंबर टू पढ़ने जा रहे हैं जिसका नाम है ग्लोब लैटिट्यूड्स एंड लॉन्गिट्यूड्स व्हाट इज ग्लोब ग्लोब इज अ मिनिएचर फ्रॉम द अर्थ ग्लोब इज अ मिनिएचर फ्रॉम द अर्थ poles the two ends of the axis are called poles there are two poles one is north pole and another is south pole equator 0 degree of parallel latitudes is term as equator this is equator beta this is equator first is parallel of latitude of 23 and 1/2 degree north of equator is called tropic of cancer tropic of cancer second parallel of latitude of 23 and 1/2 degree south of equator is termed as tropic of capricorn tropic of capricorn the value of tropic of cancer is 23 and 1/2 degree north and the value of tropic of cancer is 23 and 1/2 degree south is value of tropic of capricorn this is the image of tropic of cancer and tropic of capricorn first you see the tropic of cancer in june solstice another is tropic of capricorn december solstice you can see here north pole equator and south pole here a red line on our earth that is show the equator the value of equator is 0 degree the torrid zone between the tropic of cancer 23.5 degree north and the tropic of capricorn is 23 and 1/2 degree south covers 39.78% of the earth surface 39.78% of the earth surface is covered by torrid zone you can see in this given map here are 0 degree show the equator and 23 north degree 23 and 1/2 degree north is show the tropic of cancer and 23 and 1/2 degree show the south is show the tropic of capricorn you can see easily np in a free zone north pole and sp in a south pole free zone the polar regions also called the free zones of the earth are the regions of the planet that surrounds its geographical poles the north and south poles laying within the polar circles these high latitudes are dominated by floating sea ice covering 
much of the arctic ocean in the north and by the antarctic sea sheet on the continent of the antarctica in the south you can see in this picture here are upper side first is north pole the value is 16 66 and half degree north is we can call free zone and this is coming in arctic circle and we can see in the last the south pole south pole the value of south pole is 66 and half degree south this is free zone upper side you can see north pole and lower side you can see south pole in geography temperate latitudes of the earth lies between the subtropics and the polar circles average yearly temperatures in these regions are not extreme hot burning hot nor freezing cold temperate means moderate no more hot no more cold unlike in the tropics temperatures can change greatly here between summer and winter you can see beta arctic polar circle upper uh, on the uh, top of the given picture and next tropic of cancer the value of tropic of cancer is 23 and 1/2 degree north and then you see then other another line that is equator we can call equator the value of equ equator is 0 degree the tropic of capricorn what is the value of tropic of capricorn that is 23 and 1/2 degree south and another line is antarctic polar circle what is the value of this 66 and 1/2 degree south what are longitudes you can learn this beta with long long means meridian of longitude are drawn from the north pole to south poles and are at right angle on the equator the distance between meridians of longitude are measured in degrees of longitude each degree is further divided into minutes and minutes into seconds you can watch this picture here are 0 degree 30 degree 60 degree 90 degree 120 degree 150 degree 180 degree iske just opposite you can see 0 degree minus 30 degree minus 60 degree minus 90 degree minus 120 degree minus 150 degree and then 180 degree that is we can call longitude latitude while lines of latitudes run across a map east to west the point of latitude makes the north south position of a point on earth lines of latitude start at 0 degree at the equator and and a 90 degree at the pole everything north of the equator is known as northern hemisphere and everything south 
of the equator is known as southern hemisphere facts about lines of latitudes here are latitudinal lines on given picture you can see 0 degree 10 degree 20 degree 30 degree 40 degree 50 degree 60 70 80 and 90 degree that is show the north pole upper side and you can see the same lines are same degrees are shown written on uh, south side also okay here are known as parallels run in an east west direction measure distance north or south from the equator are parallel to one another and never meet cross the prime meridian at right angle lies in planes that cross the earth's axis at right angles get shorter towards the poles with only the equator the longest a great circle are uh, facts about lines of longitudes are known as meridians run in a north south direction measure distance east or west of the prime meridian are farthest apart at the equator and meet at the poles cross the equator at right angles lie in plans that pass through the earth's axis are equal in length are halves of great circle in this given picture you can see prime meridian prime meridian is a meridian a line of longitude in a geographic coordinate system at which longitude is defined to be 0 degree together a prime meridian and its anti meridian the 180th meridian in a 360 degree system form a greater circle this great circle divides a uh, spherid into two hemispheres a great system is a set of measurements a graphic designers can use to align and size objects within the given format it also allow us to use several grid systems on top of each other distort distort the grid system by rotating or scaling it or generating the grid modules randomly the arctic circle is one of the two polar circles and the most northerly of the five major circles of latitudes are shown on maps of earth the antarctic circle antarctic circle is the most southerly of the five major circles of latitude that mark map of the earth the region south of this circle is known as the antarctic and the zone immediately to the north is called the southern temperate zone 
the tropic of cancer is the most northern latitude on the earth where the sun can appear directly a uh, directly overhead here are five major circles are shown in this picture first is arctic circle second is tropic of cancer the value of tropic of cancer 23 and a half degree north then equator the value of equator is 0 degree next is tropic of capricorn the value of capricorn is 23 and a half degree south and last is antarctic circle the value of antarctic circle is 66 and a half degree south here are the show sun rays and earth axis the tropic of capricorn is the most southern latitude on the earth where the sun can appear directly overhead this case of the sun appearing directly overhead happens once in a year in the very height of the sum height of summer for each of the tropics you can see prime meridian line in purple color and equator in red color tropic of cancer is green color tropic of capricorn in blue color and arctic circle in green color and uh, arctic uh, sorry antarctic circle in green color and uh, arctic circle in brown color a uh, solstice is an event occurring when the sun appears to reach its most northerly or southerly excursion relative to the celestial equator on the celestial sphere two solstices occur naturally around june 21st and december 21st in many countries the seasons of the year are determined by reference to the solstice and the equinox the term solstice can also be used in a broader sense as the day when this occur the day of a solstice in either hemisphere has either the most sunlight of the year is summer solstice or least sunlight of the year is winter solstice for many place other than the equator here are some creative work for you first is draw a diagram of globe second is draw a diagram of important latitudes and heat zones here are some questions related to your revision work question 1 what is the true shape of the earth question 2 what is a globe question 3 what is the value of prime meridian what is the latitudinal value of tropic of cancer question 5 is here where is antarctic circle located the answer of question first is the earth is flattened at the poles and blux at the equator geodesy represent the features of the earth as an oblate sphere the oblate sphere or oblate ellipsoid is an ellipsoid of revolution revolution obtained by rotating an ellipse about its shorter axis answer is 
a globe is a spherical model of earth of some other celestial body or of the celestial sphere a prime meridian is a meridian a line of longitude is in geographical con geographic coordinate system at which longitude is defined to be 0 degree question 4 answer of question 4 the longitudinal value of tropic of cancer is 23 and half degree north question here is the answer of question 5 the antarctic circle is a parallel of latitude on the earth at approximately 66.5 degree south of the equator here are some question for your homework i hope you enjoy this lesson and you learn this lesson thank you bachu thank you students have a nice day